Hey everybody, this is Star Care Bear, and I just wanted to make a quick little um, video, just um, I'll call it a spring haul, I guess. Um, so I um, actually got back from the doctor um, a while back today. Um, I took a nap, so I just, my hair is a little like messed up just because um, like I went to sleep and um, just decided to touch up my lipstick and um, come make a video. So um, actually I'll be making another video on my my um, weight loss channel, which is a uh, fat to fit star care. And um, so quickly, um, I just wanted to show some things that I've gotten recently. Um, like, well, first of all, I wanted to, um, just show my um, lipstick because I don't think I've ever made a video w wearing it and um, it is this Wet n Wild um, it's called Dollhouse Pink 957 it's one of the lipsticks that I got I think around my birthday or on my birthday last year and um, it's a matte lipstick which I don't own any matte lipsticks this is this one and the other one are like the ones that I own now. And um, I get a lot of compliments on this um, lipstick. I wear it and um, you guys can see it's like a bubblegum pink. Um, but it has like a, I want to say like a purple, blue or purple um, undertone or something. So um, yeah, I just... Um, Wanted to mention that that um if you're like looking for I know these are like a dollar ninety nine or something and um it um it's like a pastel uh pink uh purple spring type of color and um something that I probably wouldn't wear um like around winter time or even though I break the rules all the time I wear what I want but so I kind of was waiting for around spring summertime to wear this and now I could wear it and I have gotten a lot of compliments so um I'm sure if you guys um can afford like high-end Mac or whatever they must have some sort of dupe like this that you guys could um um get you know if you want a high quality um matte lipstick and um yeah uh, so just wanted to show my little headband here and it's got a little bow and um, kind of matches the lipstick I was trying to make the lipstick match more with my outfit so like when I when I style an outfit or whatever I pretty much um, kind of sort of try to match everything and I know it's like a lot of people don't think it's cool like to match lipstick with eye makeup and you know even though I didn't do eye makeup or whatever but um I don't know guys I just like doing that I will match if I have a purse that's like this color we'll take the purse or something that has to match I don't, I'm just very matchy matchy and at first I had worn this headband because I thought it matched more with um the shirt but I think it the shirt matches more with that one so yeah, I should have worn that one. And um, these are really cute. I actually had purchased these at Walgreens from their little like cheapy dollar bin. Um, I think last year. I just think they're very cute. And don't mind my nails. I um had them done, but obviously didn't get around to doing them. So I'm very um. When it comes to nail maintenance, I'm very, like, lazy. I will just wait until my nails, like, completely chip off, and then I will go redo them because most of the time I don't have any nail polish remover or I just, like, <laughs> I'll do it later or whatever. So I want to show you guys this um, shirt, which is one of my haul items, and it's this baby pink, um, pastel pink shirt 
and if you guys see there's like a design on here and um it's got like a bicycle i don't know if you guys can see that i'm trying to pull it out obviously it like tucks under my um cleavage and under my boobs and my stomach sometimes i gotta pull my my shirts out like that so it, I think it's so, like, really cute. Like I said, it has a bicycle on there. And um, I had to wear this, like, little black, um, it's like a little bolero crop thingy because um, it's actually pretty, the weather's been kind of cool. Actually, it hasn't been hot. Like, it gets hot, like, one day, and then it, it goes back to being cold. So, anyways, um... And the shirts that I bought were $5, and so I thought Walmart did a good um, sale or whatever, so I got those online, and this is like the only one that had that I got that had a print, because by the time I went to the website, I don't know, it's just like everything's so picked over, like, um, they don't have any, um, anything on the website anymore, like you want to click and buy something, and it's just like, Sold out, sold out, sold out. So, I actually really, really like this shirt. And it's like a spring type of color. And uh, everything I had ordered online, some things I bought at the store. But I will let you know what, what what did I get. So, this is the packaging. And I will show you guys the other shirts. And I um, actually ended up ordering four solid color shirts and um here they are so they're still in their packaging i will pretty much leave them in there until i'm ready to wear them or whatever and um i'll just show you guys the colors these are all by just my size and then this one is like a um pastel like green blue it's like a green blue it's actually like a green blue I don't know yeah so I got that um I know I shouldn't really have like gone out to buy clothes but I thought for five dollars and they're just like I really don't have any light colors like for spring or summer so I think these are just so nice you know and um the other one that i got is a kind of like another version of this color and it's a um it's like um a purple so this one matches the lipstick more a little bit more than this pink one um so it's like I would say like a like a orchid or purple lilac color and then I got two kind of more summery not so springy colors which is this blue like straight up um cobalt cobalt or teal blue it's like a mixture between cobalt and teal and then the last one that I got was this pink, of course, you know, my pink, my hot pink. And um, so, yeah, I'm really happy that I got to get these for five bucks. So it's like for $25, I ended up getting these beautiful, like, cup shirt thingies. So they're t-shirts, you know, they're, but they're very, um, they're comparable to the ones that that Target has. Um, the only difference, obviously, I think, is um, the price. And actually, I prefer these over the Target ones just because I think um, they're better quality. Like, I'm very impressed with this. The quality is really good. The ones from Target are very, very thin. And they're like $10. And if you get them on sale, they're $8 probably. So... Yeah, I'm like, Walmart people, Walmart. <laughs> and I actually had ordered um, 
kind of like to go with my shirts. I ordered shorts and um, I had ordered kind of like the similar, the similar colors, like this pink one right here. And, um, you know, well, actually it doesn't match the pink, but there's this like pink one right here. And, um, I actually ordered a gray one here. And, um, a hot pink one. And, um, And then actually um, had um, this other kind of like green, bluish green one that I had ordered. And um, now the problem with all of these is that they're the wrong size. They sent me a 2X. I'm not a 2X. <laughs> um, so they sent me the wrong size. So now I have to go either take these all back or and then some of these on here says like maternity like maternity shorts which to me I'm like no I'm not pregnant so um yeah let me continue on with um with my haul here um just trying to get everything situated. Another thing that I bought was a pair of black leggings that I've never really purchased, but I don't know. I just thought it'd be nice to get a pair, and I I'm really impressed with the quality. Like they're really nice and stretchy and things like that. The only thing with me is I don't wear leggings as pants. Um, a lot of people do. I don't. <laughs> So these are not going to be worn like with anything other than like like um very long shirt or with um like a since I don't like showing my legs with a dress I just I have really bad ugly really ugly legs <laughs> they're very ugly and um fat and um since last year that I was sick in the hospital, my legs are very, I don't know what to say. Um, they're very scaly looking and very horrible. So if I wear like a little cute dress or something, I will wear my, my leggings. And <clears throat> the last clothing item that I got from Walmart was a, I apologize guys if it, this it's very annoying to get them out of the bags. <laughs> I just try to keep everything in the bags just in case, like, I have to return or, or you know, whatever. But, or wait until I wear it. I had, um, went and got this. Wow. <laughs> this is really big, guys. Uh, you should pretty much already see that I don't have a little waist. <laughs> Not yet. Actually, if I fold it, it'll be, like... This would be the ideal waist that I would have right here. Okay. So this is like a swim, uh, like bottom. And then it has like the little, um, the shorts on the bottom. And then it has like the little skirt. And, um, last year I started swimming, but unfortunately, because of my legs, the doctor said I shouldn't. And this year, I really want to start going back to swim again. So I got this bottom just because I do have a black one where it's the same thing. And then you have your the other one's just panties. This one, at least, is shorts. And um, but that other one is really big. And if I start losing some weight, I'm going to really not be able to do anything with it unless I sew on the sides of it or something. And what I liked about this one is that it has this little pull thing here. So if I do end up losing weight, it's just like you can pull it and pull it and pull it. And it'll actually make it really like a decent, you can tighten it really, really good. Like I'm talking about to the point where it will make the little 
<laughs> the little thing. So, yeah, I figured um, I can use my, my swim top from my other bathing suit with this one. I don't know if it'll match because this one's pink. My swim suit is... Um, I think it's red or something with flowers or something. So, that was it for all the clothing things that I have bought. And, um, actually, I will... Oh, I want stuff to fall here. Um, I actually will show you guys what I bought at the actual Walmart store for my, my dogs. So... Walmart bag, Walmart, and um, I'm not one of those people that that is like really into being real weird with their their dogs. Even though I say they're my kids and things like that, but I guess there goes that phone. Shoot, I don't want to edit the video. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I get so so like uh now that the internet is running i'm like so happy that the internet is getting better so that i don't have to wait like eight hours to upload a 20 minute video so anyways i swear i get so aggravated with the house phone because it's just telemarketers companies or whatever so first of all i got the the flea treatment for ticks and fleas now that summer's coming i want to have my dogs protected so it's like for the little doggies here it says for dogs and puppies from 5 to 14 which i have bella might be bigger than 14 pounds but i know for a fact blue is really skinny she's a little anorexic dog and then i actually ended up getting this for Bella, it's a muzzle and um, yeah, it's horrible that I have to like put a muzzle on that dog. But the reason being is that I kind of want to take over um, doing my dog's grooming. I just kind of feel kind of bad. Last time I took Bella to the groomers, she bit the, the groomer. So yeah. I, I would felt very bad with the owner. The owner's like, oh, she's fine. Don't worry about it. And I'm just like, oh, I don't want to get sued. I'm like, so I felt really bad. And um, so I got these clippers. And I am going to put the muzzle because they had to call me, actually call me and tell me that my daughter had bit the groomer and that I personally had to put the muzzle. So... I had to put the muzzle in on top of that. I had to actually hold Bella because she really freaked out. So here's the muzzle right here. Obviously, her nose will go in. Snout goes in here. Then you adjust it to the back. And actually, Alan will be holding her. My husband, He um, she kind of behaves more around him than with me because... Mama lets her get away with murder, according to him. And um, so, I'm not the disciplinary. <laughs> My husband is. So, I got those things. And then, I just really thought... <sighs> I saw these, and I was just couldn't resist. Because I don't have children, guys. I never got pregnant, ever, in my whole entire life. Never um, had a baby, obviously, since I never got pregnant. Never tried getting pregnant. It just... Um, it wasn't like something that I focused on as far as like being a mother and things like that. So, but when I see things like this for like little kids, I get so like, like jealous. I'm like, oh, I wish I had a kid so I can buy cute little outfits. And then I had seen this adorable little thing and I was like, oh my God, this is just too stinking cute. Like, <laughs> it's just like, I couldn't resist. So this is um, by the brand Simply Dog, $7.97, extra small, because this is for the anorexic one. This is for blue. This is the smallest they have, and I think this is still going to be a little, a little big for her. So, yeah, 
and then I bought another one for my big girl, Bella. She's the oldest, and this one I just, I couldn't resist, guys. Like I said, it just, when I seen it, I was like, it's for her, because my husband always says how, um, there's the tag right there, Simply Dog, $9.97. This one's medium, because my Bella's a big girl, and she's big, like her mama. She's she's a little plump, and um, my husband always makes fun of, of uh, how bad she is, and, and how mommy lets her do whatever. So, when I seen this, I was like, oh my god. It says mommy's wild child because she is wild. And trust me, my husband actually hasn't seen these outfits. When he sees these, he's going to trip out because he's going to be like, you're one of those crazy dog people, <laughs> crazy cat ladies. So look at this cute outfit. Like if I got, if I didn't tell you this was for a dog, you guys would think this was for, for a little girl. It's just so cute. But obviously in the back, you can tell. How freaking cute. It says Mommy's Wild Child. It's got the stripes. Then it's got the little little tutu thing here. And it's got even these little studs here on the thing. I really hope she fits into this because it's a medium. She might have needed a small, but I don't know. She's kind of chunky. So, <sighs> Yeah, guys. I know. I know. I, I need professional help. I just, I can't help myself with my dog. They're like my kids. So, I know a lot of people are like, you are very crazy girl. But, um, I'm trying to see. The last things that I bought were actually, um, not from Walmart. They're, um, I'll just throw them in here. And, um, it's from... The dollar store. I know a lot of people don't shop at the dollar store. I like going to the dollar store. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I like. I don't know. I just like things there <laughs> that I'm just like. I like going there. So um. I actually just went and I found these like um, just browsing around the imitation perfumes, and actually I got one for myself. And there goes the phone again. I really need to start editing my videos or I need to turn off the phone for when I make my videos. I don't want to make long videos guys. Cause I feel like a lot of people, they just sort of like stop rambling so much, <laughs> get to the point. But since I only make a video like once in a while, I kind of bunch it all up together. Alrighty then. So I have, I got the pink one and then I got the black one for Alan, my husband. And, um, he, um, I feel bad because I really don't buy him any cologne. Like, honestly, I think it's his own fault because <laughs> I think one time I did go and, um, purchase, I want to say Perry Ellis. I don't even remember. And he drowned himself in the bottle. Like in two days, the bottle was gone. And I was like, that was like $70 or something like that. I'm like, no. So I'm like, basically, I'm the same way too. I really, I, I put on a lot of perfume. <laughs> the way I see it, bigger people need more perfume than skinny people. That's how I justify it. You know, like I have a bigger body so anyways um and plus i sprayed like my hair <laughs> i just like i spray my clothes and my hair and whatever i just don't just like put like a little drop behind my ear i'm like spray my hair spray my clothes spray this sometimes i spray my purse sometimes i spray my shoes <laughs> i don't know i'm crazy like that so I go through a lot of perfume as well. So um, sometimes I just go ahead and get imitation. And then there's times where I get compliments on my dollar store perfumes. And people think that I like, oh, you must have some 
really expensive perfume on i'm like not really it's like a from the dollar store so um this one says that it is victoria's secret bombshell the knockoff victoria's secret and um this one's called stunner i actually obviously like the packaging it's pink Obviously, you know, not everybody's uh, cup of tea is the imitation. A lot of people are very, like, like, hell no, I ain't gonna wear that, like, dollar store perfume. But here is the bottle. I think it's really pretty. It's pink. Even just for the bottle. I've been suckered in so much with these dollar store bottles that I have perfumes that, that they they really smell nasty. But the bottle was so cute and... I love perfume bottles. I collect them. One day I will probably do a perfume collection. This one's called Stunner. And it's like this. And it's actually a really nice, clean, I want to say summer scent. I wouldn't say it was a fall or winter, but it smells very fresh. So it's a very spring, summer type. Actually smells kind of guyish as well, like something a man would wear. But and this is what I wore today. And I like it. You know, I'm actually not disappointed in that purchase. <laughs> actually like that one. And um this is my husband's and I still haven't given it to him. He's gonna freak out when I give it to him. Cause he's gonna be like, Wow, you bought me perfume again. Even though we've been together six years and I only bought him one bottle in six years. <laughs> It's horrible. So this one is called Touche to Verdict Dark. And then it says Impression of Gucci Guilty Black. Gucci Guilty Black. And actually, it's not bad. You know, it's like, I don't know a Gucci. I'm assuming Gucci is like $100 perfume. Assuming, guys. I don't, I don't really by designer perfumes or whatever so and this is the bottle it's got blue liquid in it black bottle and actually smells really good guys it smells like like clean summer just um when a man takes a shower and throws this on and like yeah, actually, our um, anniversary is coming up next week of the day that we actually met. So, um, I don't, I don't know if he's gonna get me anything because I pretty much like am allowed to like get myself whatever I want. So kind of like he gave me the permission of this purchase. He was like, well, I don't need permission from him. But he was, I was like, I don't know if I want to buy things, especially these clothes, because I'm transitioning to losing weight. And he was just like, go ahead and get those and let that be your anniversary gift or whatever. And, um, you know, and, or he'll probably get me a card or something or make me one. But I think this would be a cute little anniversary gift for him. Yeah, I met him six years ago. So, yeah, six years. The day we met. Actually, we met on his mom's birthday, so gotta get his mom something probably for her birthday. And um, last but not least, in this whole haul, because it's running to 30 minutes and I made it pretty long. I'm sorry guys, I apologize. Was um this blanket that I just couldn't resist and um I really, um, really, really like it. It's, it's like the hot pink. Then it has like a design with like white, like, and, um, I just wanted a, like a lighter blanket. This is like a, like a thinner since winter's over, you know, I don't need those big bulky blankets. And actually this one is going to go here in my room. Um, so, yeah, I um also just wanted to have something 
my um, aunt will probably be visiting when I have my surgery. So I wanted to have something nice for her to lay on. And I just really, really like it. And so it is, it was 20, 20 dollars. And um, yeah, it's, it says it's either for a full or a queen, which I have a full. And it's reversible. So you can, you know, make it look pink or the other design and stuff like that. And even though, guys, these walls are not coming up true to color, they're coming up like a pink, light, lighter pink than they are. So they're, they're actually a very dip, deeper pink. I think it's just the lighting. So that's it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed my spring haul. And I will see you guys soon i hope and um uh, go to my other channel because i'll be filming my my update and everything as soon as i'm done filming this one so see you later guys take care god bless bye